on November 16th, 2020. I exposed a game breaking method that allowed me to achieve level 1 to 99 fletching in just 1 hour and 38 minutes time, which happens to be the fastest 1 to 99 fletching ever completed on old school RuneScape until today. I set forth to absolutely dominate my own world record with one goal in mind, complete the first ever sub 1 hour 1 to 99 and cement it in the record books forever. Before we could start our 99 speedrun, we need to have all of our supplies prepared beforehand. Our first purchase and trade of supplies, our second purchase, and third, costing us a total of 718 million GP and giving us just about everything we need to start our speedrun. But before we get into the fletching, welcome to Raid Shadow Legends, one of the most popular games out now and one of my most favorite games to play. If you haven't heard about Raid Shadow Legends yet, here's a good start. Meet the newest and craziest boss in Raid, the Hydra. It's a giant beast with multiple different heads, each one a complete boss battle all on its own. The Head of Suffering wants you to suffer, and the Head of Decay slowly weakens your team over time while healing the other heads. My favorite part about Raid Shadow Legends is how rewarding it is to level up my champions and receive new loot after battles. The amount of champions to choose from and endless amounts of content is one of the reasons this game is my go-to. Oh, and if the biggest, baddest boss in the entirety of mobile games isn't enough for you, there's more. Raid's also giving away a super limited edition champion to every player in the game. Some of you may recognize him already, it's Esports Legend and Navi Superstar Simple. This is the best time to get started in Raid. And if you use my link or scan the QR code right here, new players will get some free resources and a free mystery champion straight away to kickstart your game. I'm not telling you who it is, but trust me, they're awesome. Hit my link and see who you'll get. The way this works is simple. I've set a two hour timer on the clock and we're gonna be using darts all the way to 99, but with a little bit of a twist. If you happen to be one of the 400,000 that's seen the last fletching video I made, you would have found out that I was able to find a bypass for one of the core functions in fletching darts, which allows me to use a client that tens of thousands of players use every single day's function to make an unhumanly possible amount of darts in a short amount of time, allowing us to get XP rates I couldn't ever imagine was possible. Now, after completely exposing how I did it, how it's against the rules, it's now 408 days later, and I have complete access to the account, which leads me to believe we must have not done it fast enough. Gaining over 10 million XP per hour apparently wasn't enough for Jagex's systems to pick it up. So we're not only going for the first ever sub 1 hour 99 on old school RuneScape, but we're going to push the limits and see if Jagex's bot protection can pick this up. Fifty six minutes. The total time it took us to achieve a 99 on old school runescape. And we didn't just stop there. Within this client, there's ways we can train other skills as well. With rapid record breaking speed, let's see how fast we can get 99 prayer. The way this method works is simple. The client changes the action of placing a bone on the altar into a singular click movement, thus allowing us to use a built-in auto clicker within the client to put unlimited amounts of bones on the altar as fast as the game allows us to. And that's not all. Another feature of the client is having invincibility in the wild. The client is somehow able to automatically detect if there's a PK or any sort of player around your combat level and it instantly logs your account out, enabling us to use the Chaos Alter special ability while making it virtually impossible to be PK. And with that combination, we should be able to get millions upon millions of experience per hour 
and absolutely break the world record for 99 prayer. It's now two months in the future. The last clip we got breaking the world record for 99 prayer was the last time I ever signed on to this account. I wanted to give Jagex ample time to see if they detected anything. And as I suspected, they didn't. And with all that being said, if this account remains unbanned, I believe the community deserves it. So this is the email to the account and I've scattered the eight character long password all throughout this video. If you find the password, Sign into the 99 Prayer and Fletching account and do whatever you want with it. And quickly before you go, I appreciate that you made this far into the video. So I'm going to toss one of you your very own Fletching training kit and Prayer training kit. Just like the video, leave your RuneScape name in the comment section below so I know how to contact you. And be sure to subscribe so you get notified when I upload my new videos. And if you happen to care, I lost around 500 million GP getting both 99s for this video.